Could you tell us what's going on? I'm happy to tell you what's going on. All right. <laughs> Remington, which you know, has a management agreement to manage this hotel. And they signed a 10-year agreement. They're six years into the agreement. They better have a dispute with the party that has a 99-year lease here, which Mr. Halpern is their representative, not the owner. And that's in litigation. And Mr. Halpern, last night after 12 o'clock, came in here with members of the police force and said, we're taking over the hotel. He has no right under the law to do it. There's no court order to do it. There's nothing that permits him to do it. And he tried to do that last night. So obviously we were kind of caught unaware. And we're back right now to take back the hotel, which we have a rightful right to manage until such time as either our contract runs out or a court. I'm going to ask that you step outside of these. We must conduct ourselves. Well, let's get, let's get some, somebody here. Can we all act like gentlemen? We can do that. We will stand outside on the porch. We're not going to leave. Okay. okay. I, I'm not talking. Donnie? 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 Well, here's my dad approach. <laughs> Thank you. In terms of working here, the warmth and friendliness of the fellow workers is what keeps you coming back, and the guests that we have are wonderful. In terms of the administration and the major company, they just make you bristle sometimes. They just, they just don't care about you, and they make it obvious. Right. We're nothing to them, nothing of importance, and they make it very clear. 